Okay guys, welcome back, Vixen Cards here, and if you saw part one, bit chaotic, so I had a five year old on my lap trying to unbox with me. This is part two, and I'm going to be doing a booster box this time. Last time we opened a Zyken, is that the right one? I think it's Zyken this one. A Sword and Shield Elite Trainer Box, which is pretty snazzy, it's one of the more snazzier trainer boxes they've done. Which is very nice and we opened up some loose Japanese packs in part one I did actually manage to pull these three amazing cards especially the rainbow rare this is actually the first rainbow rare that I've ever been able to pull um, I always wanted a rainbow rare Palkia or Dialga or anything like that but unfortunately I never managed to pull one back in those sets so we are going to open a full Japanese VMAX Horizon Booster Box. I've got one there that I'll be selling on my Depop shop. Links down below and a my username on the screen right now. Uh, so you can go and pick one up. Pick some packs up yourself. And we'll get into this booster box. Da -da -da. I like this boost I like Japanese booster box, they give you Oh okay, they don't anymore. I'm lying. What they used to do. I've got an old one here somewhere. Oh, I've got a Dream League one. So Dream League came with those booster packs. Check things so you could actually keep track of what you got and what you haven't. We don't have that luxury anymore. Here we are, here's all the boosters. Let's get right into it. So I couldn't really talk in the last one, uh, last part. Part one was me trying to make sure Archie didn't destroy it. all of the nice cards. He might have dented the the V card Victini, which is uh, not great. But here we are. Right. So here we've got a water water bucket type thing trainer card we got snova we got bunnelby bunnelby or it's pre-evolution we got a coral and we have got a blah 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 what's it called arcane arcane yeah no yeah growl life arcanine that's it my mind is going blank today. My mind is frazzled with all this coronavirus stuff. I um, My full-time job, apart from me Depop shop, is I work for my parents' company. I help them run it. Um, very stressful times, uncertain times for everyone. Obviously, everyone's getting angry on the phone because it's a customer service-based job. And I'm just happy to be home and with these beautiful cards. One to the front. Oh, we've at least got a hollow on the back. I saw that. It's got a Mr. Rhyme. We've got a Halucha. We've got Stone Edge. Stone Edge? Shh. I'm really getting this muddled up. Yeah, maybe. We've got a Binacle. And we've got a Hollow Gyarados, which we actually pulled in the loosed Japanese packs in part one. We've got one there, and we've got a Corsola, maybe. Maybe that's what it's called. Let's have a look. Sometimes you can, like, ease... Oh, rip them like that, there we go. Spoke too soon end up damaging the cards that way though it's not always brilliant so here we have got the grass type gym from the game we've got a coral we've got a grubbin a vulpix and a standard nine towers for the uh, uncommon right let's get a flow going 
we got a skunky a toxel a natu and i didn't do the card trick but we have a surf fetched hollow very nice japanese cards the hollows always have a hollow edge around them as well which i quite like to be honest One to the front. What do we have here? We've got the grass gym again. Another one of those. Another grub in. A surfetched, I think. Shuckle. And that is all for that pack. I'm trying to pull something big. Barracuda. Nice. Heliosk, Esper, is that, a, no that's not Esper, is it? I have no idea, Barracudas, oh, <coughs> oh I'm excited, Barracudas Pre-Evolution and a VMAX Cinderace, we have the Japanese uh, Standard Secret and we have the Japanese Rainbow Rare there as well, very nice cards, I'm going to sleeve this one up straight away. Boom. Beautiful stuff. That's a lovely card. Let's keep going. Hopefully we can get some more pulls like that. One to the front. I keep drifting off all over the place. You can tell I haven't really done many of these videos. We have the grass type gym leader. Growl life. Uh, Impidimp. Impy Dimp, Impy Dip, something like that. Halucha and a Toxel with the great artwork again. Amazing. The artwork this time has been brilliant. Um, like I was trying to say earlier, the this is a really good time for Pokemon. There's going to be some great, um, some great sets this year, especially with the new, some of the new Pokemon. Why can't I open this one? One to the front. Right, let's go. Oh, we got another um What is wrong? Toxic toxicity. Um very nice. I can see the hollow in the back. I'm so bad at this. We've got a Caterpie, a Morgan, a Binacle, and we've got a hollow apple ton. Very nice. One to the front. We got an Ab Absnoman. I'm forgetting all the uh, forgetting all the names today. Mr. Mind Galarian, another Caterpie, a Hone Edge, I think, I believe, and we've got another Cinderace V card. So we have now got the standard V card. We've got the V Max and the Rainbow Rare V Max. That is insane. That is literally insane that I've managed to pull them. Let's get a pack for this bad boy as well. Alright, let's get into this one. Wow, they launched. Elf, there's no good cards in here. But Toxel, Phalynx, Halucha. Uh, I'm gonna say that starts with a C, but yeah, beautiful. Hold firm with your Pokemon cards. We got normal energy. We've got the pre-evolution of Helioesk, Apple, Applin, Hone Edge, I believe, or Stone Edge. I literally can't remember. And a Barnacle, just a. Standard. Yeah, some sometimes the Japanese artwork is so so uh, good. I can't. I sometimes think it's a a hollow when it's not. But we got a Natu, for Lynx, a Magikarp, 
and I forgot to do the trick, but there we have a hollow Dragapult there. Very nice artwork. That's lovely. And a Bunnel B. Right, we've got the card trick. Here we are. See, there's something good on the back. There's at least a hollow. I keep ruining it for myself. But we've got the, the scientist's name. I can't even remember her name. A metapod with the like realistic artwork. Very nice. We've got the small little rabbit. And we got a pre-evolution to Dragapult. And then on the back, I must have been dreaming because there's no hollow there. Well, I'm an idiot. Okay, so right here we've got Shuckle, Droopy, Snova, Mr. Mime, and a hollow Voltorp. I cannot remember the name. Very nice. Obviously, grub. There's grubbing. I mean, it evolves into this uh, like bust, bust-looking Pokemon, and then it evolves into this. Very nice. Next on the list, we've got Bunnelby. Pre-evolution to. I can see it on the edge. I'm so. I'm really bad at this. Pre-evolution to Dragapult. We have got a Binacool, a Heliosk, and another. Hollow Dragapult. Very nice. Any doubles I get of hollows and such, I will be posting on my Depop shop. So we got an Arcanine, we got a Skunky, a Natu, a Magikarp, and Leon's House. Down the front. Boom. Cramanaut. Why is that coming into my head? It's I don't think it is. It's the one that spits out fish and Pikachu on rare occasions, Growl Life. Um Barracudas Pre oh, why that? Applin and we got the uh double is it double? I think so. V card, very nice. Very nice card. Let's leave that bad boy up as well. To the front, beautiful. Leon's house, Sir Fetched, Impy Dimp, Bronzor, and we got a Butterfree. Butterfree is a fan favourite, I feel like. to the front. I just saw we got something good as well. Shuckle, Toxel, Grubbin, Phalanx, and a VMAX Rillaboom. Now the other VMAX uh, Rillaboom I got, what was it? Oh, it was the Japanese one as well. I thought it might have been the English one. But no, I got two of those. So I will be selling this one on my Depop shop. You can expect it on there very, very soon. Beautiful, beautiful cards. I just launched one on the floor. We'll save that one to the end. Maybe it's got good luck in it or something. One to the front. Brongzong, Brongzor, whatever. <sighs> I can't remember the name. It's like Electrobug Grub or something like that. Electrobug Grub? I'm going to say that. Vulpix, Caterpie, and we've got a hollow Drawalodon. I honestly can't remember the names of any of these, which is stupid because I play so much, uh, so much Pokemon Sword and Shield, it's unreal. So I'm pretty sure it's Drawalodon or something like that. 
We've got a girl I don't recognise. We've got a skunky, a binacle, a dreepy, an ab snowman for the last card. Okay, we've got a toxicity tree there. We've got a hone edge or whatever it's called. Keep getting that one wrong, I think. We've got a Morgan, Heliosk, and we've got a hollow. Um, my one's called Elizabeth. I'm not even joking. Because I've got a shiny one of these in Pokemon Shield. And I thought, where the shiny one's white, I thought it looked like Queen Elizabeth. And it reminded me of it, to be honest. But I cannot remember the name for the life of me. This is probably the most unprofessional packet opening you're ever going to watch. Okay, we've got the scientist, we got bronzer, whatever that is, can't remember, skunky, and we got a Natu's evolution for the end there. Okay, we've gone one to the front, we've got Jewel Edge, Jewel Edge, Jewel Edge, this little Pikachu ripoff, Growl Life, Natu. And very nice, we got a Fallout Trainer card. That is very nice. Ooh, look at the reflections on that. Very nice, that's Milo. That's what that guy's name is called. Milo. I'll sleeve him up straight away. On to the front. Milo, so fetched, Appling, Dreepy, and a Skun Tank. Not great as the packs, but we've done pretty well so far. One nice thing about the um, Japanese packs is you always get a secret rare. So we've got a Nine Tails, Pikachu Ripoff, Snova, Palucha, and a Skun Tank. Onto the front. So here we've got a normal energy, we've got a Mr. Mime, we've got a coral, we've got a stone edge, <laughs> a sword edge, and then we've got a V card. Um, I can't believe it. Silly Cobra's evolution. Blah, 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 blah. Can't remember what it's called. But what a lovely V card. Can see this bad boy up as well. What an... lovely. We've had pretty good luck with this booster box as well. So we've got Jewel Jewel Edge. We've got Maggie Carp, we've got Snova, Impidimp, and then we've got a V-card Intellion on the back, which is insane. This is this is incredible luck. Incredible luck. Look at that. Beautiful cards. Here we got the lady I don't know again, little rabbit, grub, fishy, and weird thing. And, but we've got one more pack that I threw on the floor. Right, so. And let's have a look at that. Last pack, can it bring us any insane luck? Let's have a look. I think I saw something, I'm not sure. Trainer card, dragger. Drag or something, Toxel, Metapod, Arcanine, and that is it. So, I'm not going to lie, pretty good going. As far as a booster box goes. Them two we got in the loose packs. Which was, I had nine of those. These are from the booster box. Pretty good going. 
But the amount of V-cards in this booster box... So, let me have a think. What did we pull before? So we pulled the Rainbow Rare... And one of those Rillabooms. And the Victini. So one booster box, I got V-card Inteleon. V-card Cobra. The ground type, can't remember what it's called. A full art Milo. We got a VMAX Rillaboom, a V card Dub Wall, a V card Cinderace, and then the VMAX Cinderace as well. The fact that we have now pulled in a booster box and nine packs all three Cinderaces is pretty insane. It's a shame my favourite out of the lot is Inteleon. And I'm waiting for that Zykon card as well. Oh well. Well there we are, that's it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. That was a little bit more of a serious and thought out one than the previous one with Archie. Just because, you know, having a five year old in your lap that wants to touch everything can be a little bit chaotic. But I get some people might prefer to see that actually. But please like, subscribe. Like I said, we'll be selling some of these doubles on my Depop shop. Um, so yeah, if you wanted to go check that out, you're more than welcome. Uh, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.